Hi friends, it's Tracy from the Financial Freedom Diary and today we are back to do my grocery haul for week number two. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe below. Hope y'all are having a super fantastic day. My director, he had to work last night so he's asleep. He didn't set me up so I don't remember squatting last week. <laughs> it's, 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 it's highly probable that I may have but I just don't remember. And so everything that's on the left side came from Aldi and everything on the right came from Walmart. So let's start with the Aldi side. Alrighty, so where are we going to start? Let's do with the, the healthy stuff. So I got some grapes and the grapes were $3.92. I got two bags of these bacon Caesar salad kits and they were $2.99 a piece. I also got another bag of red potatoes. I think this is for to knock this bag off the table. Um, and the red potatoes are $3.79. Um, I also got myself some grilled chicken. And they are $5.79. And I will probably throw that into the salad kit. Just in case I need to quickly just make my lunch or whatever. Because I got quite a few meals this week. Um, I have the breaded chicken breast fillets and this costs $6.29. These are the ones that I was telling you guys that kind of taste just like um, Chick-fil-A. They're chicken sandwiches. And they're hard to find, at least at my Aldi, it's, it's very hard to find. And so I got some salsa for $1.19. I also got some taco seasoning and they were 38 cents a piece. This is the low sodium, so I got two of those. Um, I also got a double, double, dozen <laughs> eggs for $1.42. And I got some brioche buns for $3.69. And so I'll be making at least one of my lunches I'm going to have a chicken sandwich. That'll be nice. And then I got some bacon, and the bacon is 409. And I also got these chicken breasts right here, and they are tagged at 1102. But they actually had uh, 20 cents off per pound, and so they actually rung up for nine dollars and 91 cents. And I got two bananas for my banana peanut butter banana toast. And they were 38 cents. No, they were 34 cents. And so that is everything from the Aldi. And so my total for Aldi was $50.35. So let me scooch on over here <laughs> to the Walmart side of things. Um, we're going to start here at the back. I got some forks and spoons for, that's if I turn the page, 562. Sorry y'all, I am unorganized. And personal, I got this uh, triple action toner. This is from Neutrogena and it was $7.18. Miss Chanel, she told me about two other ones and they were nicely priced. I looked for them and I couldn't find them in um, my Walmart, but I did find this one. I think this was like the only toner that I saw in there, but some of them, I couldn't tell exactly what it was because it didn't specifically say toner. Um, but Neutrogena, typically, I don't have any bad reactions to their products either. So for the Fritos, they were $3.48. And I'm going to make chili today. And so I'm going to use the Fritos just in case anybody wants those. Um, and I call it Cheater Chili because this is one where you're not soaking the beans and slow cooking everything. <laughs> And this is the triple cheddar shredded cheese. And so I'll use that to sprinkle on top of the chili. And that was $2.78. The Tostitos chips are $3.48. I got an eyebottle rebate that I'm going to use on these. And I'll put that on the screen what that was for because I can't remember. I feel like it's 10 cents or something like that. Um, I got a four pound bag of navel oranges. So the grapes, the oranges, I got some apples, that's my candy. <laughs> so the oranges are $5.23. I got some mozzarella cheese because I'm also going to make a lasagna this week. And the mozzarella cheese is $4.88. I got some oven ready lasagna and this was 
um, a dollar and sixty-eight cents. I got some sugar. That's for my youngest son, and it's two dollars because he needs to make coffee in the morning, and he doesn't. He is a real sugar person. <laughs> um, the Tennessee Pride. This is the country. The hot sausage. And I normally don't get hot, but I couldn't find the regular one, and it is three thirty-two. I thought I wouldn't put two in there, but I also got the Jimmy Dean's, um, and this is the regular sausage, and it's four dollars. So I'm gonna make a pepperoni and sausage lasagna. So I typically have two, but I like regular, and there was only one of those. Uh, my pepperoni is three dollars and forty-six cents. I also got some pork chops. And these are the boneless ones, and they were twelve forty one, and so they were twenty cents all per pound. So I got those because that's going to go with the red potatoes when I do the ranch potatoes. But I have some carrots. I may throw that in there too. Um, but I do need another side though. I got some parsley flakes. Sorry, y'all. Got some parsley flakes. Uh, that was ninety eight cents. The let me move my stuff on around. The chopped spinach was a dollar, and then of course, I got my cheese heads, which is my snack. When I can't stop snacking, this is what I'll eat. Um, and it's three dollars and 22 cents, so I got two of those, so that's one for me, one for my son. And the ricotta cheese was a dollar and 74 cents. I also got some cheese, cheddar cheese soup. I use that when I make my um, macaroni and cheese, the bacon mac and cheese in the crock pot. And so I like to throw that in there, kind of like a, a base in there. So yeah, and how much was that? <laughs> I'm over here talking about what I'm gonna use it for. That was a dollar and 48 cents. So I think I covered everything from the Walmart and I spent $76 and 35 cents total at the Walmart. But I think I gave you guys some insight into what I'm cooking today, which is the chili. Uh, we're going to have pork chops at some point uh, this week. And we're also going to have the lasagna, which probably, I will probably be eating chili. But my kids will probably be eating lasagna. But later, because they're not real big on leftovers. But anywho, that is everything. Hopefully when I break this all down and, and on Saturday, I am within budget. Sometimes I'm not, y'all know I'm not. <laughs> I'm not perfect. But hopefully I'm within budget in all my categories. And y'all let me know how was your grocery haul this week. And I will talk to you guys later. Y'all have a great one. Bye.